So check this out. Listen to everybody that buys things and lets them sit. I wasn't planning on doing my tractor maintenance until the spring, of course. Um, so I bought this rigid 18 volt grease gun and it looked brand new. It was $274 and I bought it from Home Depot. Um, but when I opened it up, um, now that I think back, it was wrapped funny. These, a lot of times these are in plastic, but maybe they aren't now, but they were just in there. But the grease gun already had grease in it. And if you look, it's got hair and whatever other unmentionables in there. So when you pay $275 for a, a grease gun, you kind of want it brand new. Um, so I called him Home Depot, my local Home Depot, where I got it. Unfortunately, I got it in uh, the end of September. And here we are, almost May. This is the first time I opened it. And I didn't want anything more than the policy. That's my fault for not opening it. But they said, um, well, first of all, Ridge is not, is not a Home Depot brand. And I think she's confused. Um, because as far as I know, unless something's changed, that's their professional brand. Um, so she said, uh, Rigid isn't our, isn't a Home Depot brand and you'll have much better luck with a manufacturer. I do, I still have my receipt, but I did not open the, the box until today. So they said, call the manufacturer, which I think I'll do tomorrow. Um, it's a Sunday and it is quarter after seven. Look at that crap in there. It's just, you know, I'm going to have to clean it out. I don't know why it was returned. I'm assuming it works okay. I don't have any clue. Um, but it's just disappointing to buy a new product and then have it restuck in a box with without even being cleaned or whatever, you know, they do when they sell products without even telling you that they're reselling returned products. Uh, so anyway, we'll see what happens when I call Rigid tomorrow.